The parallel multiple run feature in PSCAD allows a user to run the same simulation repeatedly with different parameters. In PSCAD version 5, the parallel multiple run feature has been modified to be more of an all-in-one solution. The setup now involves a single project where you set up parameters in a table or custom component, and then you can set the total number of runs or tasks. Each launch will consume a single CPU core, and you can set the total number of runs at once, which is the volley. In this example, we want to run the simulation six times with different parameters, but we're going to do it in batches of three. This is very useful when you want to launch multiple simulations, but you're limited in the number of CPU cores. Ideally, you want to launch one simulation per CPU core. Let's take a look at how we set this up. This is the PMR example that comes with PSCAD version 5. This example is a simple electrical system with a fault being applied. The goal of this simulation is to run the same simulation over and over again with different fault types and fault durations. The fault type and duration defined here will be controlled by a custom component. Here. Each run of the parallel simulation will have a different rank number. This rank number will be used here and fed into the custom component, which will produce different fault times and fault delays to be used in every simulation. Let's go inside. In this example, you can see that the rank number is being used in this control system in order to define the values for fault type and fault delay. Another way of doing this is to use a table. The rank number is simply fed into this table. And in the table, you can define the different values used for fault time and fault type. In this example, you would then just take the fault delay and fault type signals here and attach them to the outputs here. For our purposes, we're going to stick with the custom component and we'll go ahead and set up the case to run. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your case and add it as a simulation set. Then you're going to set up your volley and your task count. Right click, go to options. And we see here that you've set the task count to 33, which means we want a multiple run simulation to run 33 different simulations. And maximum volley is also set to 33, which means we want to run 33 at once. To start the simulation, simply right click and run. And here you'll see all three simulations get launched at once. This is something you should really do only if you have 33 or more CPU cores available. Now let's suppose you have less CPU cores available. You could simply go to options and you could say maximum volley of three. And run it again. In this situation, with this setting, three simulations will launch at once and it'll run until 33 simulations have completed. This is ideal when you have less cores and you can adjust this number to however many CPU cores you have on your computer. This has been a brief introduction into the new parallel multiple run feature in PSCAD version 5. We hope that you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.